So here's our cube, okay? Um, we have the bottom two layers are solved, uh, and then we have the yellow cross here up top, okay? So before we can do the algorithm uh, that we talked about, we have to take um, one of the edge pieces and move it to a solved position. This is already there, but we can use a different color. Let's say we want to do this blue and yellow one, and we would just simply move this blue edge over top of its center, okay? Uh, so now it's solved there, and you see this, this, if, we, if this was actually solved, it would be red instead of green, okay? And so what we're gonna do, now that we have this in its solved position, now we can do the algorithm. Okay, it's not solved, because if it was, we're looking for the red one, so let's do it again. Just the same algorithm. And now it's solved, okay? And you can see these two are solved, but we don't have a solved state here, okay? So what do we do? So we move this, actually, this right one here over top to where it's solved, and then we do that algorithm again. And now you can see all of the edge pieces are where they're supposed to be, okay? All right? So um, hopefully that, that made sense to you. If not, leave me a question in the comments. So now we need to move to our corner pieces, okay? Because all the edge pieces are where they belong, all right? So when we're doing these algorithms, the algorithms allow you to move around pieces and then put them back uh, at the same time. That's what, what's so great about them, okay? And so the next step now is to find um, a solved corner, okay? Uh, let's see. Uh, meaning that it's in its proper position, okay? We don't have any, actually. So, like, when I say a solved corner, that means... We need a corner piece that in, is in the spot where it's supposed to be, where all three faces are, right? So the piece that should be here should be the green, orange, and yellow piece, okay? But it's not, okay? So what we do is we can do that algorithm uh, one time, the algorithm that you see there. And then now we can look again to see if we have a piece that's in its solved corner, and we do, which is right here, because we have the blue, yellow, and orange at the intersection of the blue, yellow, and orange. And now we can hold it facing us, and then we can do this algorithm again. And now, as you see, all of the corner pieces are where they belong, okay? They're not oriented properly, but they're where they belong, okay? And so now we can, because they're where they're supposed to be, now we can do that final step. So we, we hold it here. Um, facing us, um, any corner really. And then you do the algorithm that you see here and w until you get the yellow piece that's facing here, okay, up top. Once you get that up top, that's what we're trying to do, then you can move to the next corner piece. Now you don't turn your cube, you simply turn the side, put another corner piece there and then do that algorithm again until you get the yellow up top, okay? See that? Then. We got one more, we move that over to the same location and then do the algorithm again. And now here's the magic, okay? You, you, all yellow pieces are the same. We just need to turn this top piece and then there you go, you have a solved cube, okay? So, um, pretty straightforward if you ask me. It just takes practice and understanding the process. Uh, remember, take the solving guide with you, print it out. It'll come in handy and if you have some trouble, Again, um, play these videos, take it slowly, step by step. Um, and if you have any questions, make sure you leave them below and I'll try to get to you as soon as I can. All right. Appreciate you.